Hi, and welcome to a new thing that I'm doing. Uh, I've done this before. It's not new, but, you, you know. It's called Let's Draw Stuff. So, yeah, really creative name. Thank you. I appreciate it. Everything you're, you're, you're saying about me right now, that's super nice. I um, don't appreciate the mean things that you're saying. Anyway, today we're going to work on, see me while I move stuff around, we're going to work on uh, drawing something that was given to me. We're going to be fusing some Overwatch characters. Ooh. Uh, we're going to be fusing D.Va and 76. So yeah, going to be fusing those two have nothing to do with each other, so I'm trying to think of a way that I can kind of get this done. So my, my thought process here is basically, let's get a dude who's basically Agent 76, but younger. He'll probably have some sort of something. I'll be showing that. Got it. You know what? I've got it. So we have this basic outline of the character. That done there. Issues, proportions about right. Cool. So here's the basic outline to the character. Let's go ahead and get started with filling this character in with some cool stuff. Here we go. So basically, as you can see, we have this face of this character. He's a, he's a young dude. He's got kind of spiky bedhead hair because I figure you know he's got the he's trendy, kind of like uh, D DVA is. Let me give him some circuitry here to show that we got some some stuff going on while I while I have it going. But um, yeah. So basically, so far we have. That this dude, this this bro, this bro stuff who does not have a name yet, is uh, you know, he's 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 a little bit more techy. He's a little bit more. I don't know. I'm just going to stick with trendy. He's a little bit more trendy than Agent Seventy Six. Agent Seventy Six is a character kind of lost in the past, man, man against time type character. So you have this guy who's, you know, he's he's got uh, he's got the same type of headset as that's the big thing. He's got this headset kind of like the the visor, like Agent Seventy Six, but it's clear, so it's a little bit more techy, a little bit more futuristic. So, yeah, I'm gonna get this going here. I gave him those little marks, kind of like uh, DV DVA has his chin here on his cheek. But yeah, so I'm just I'm, I'm just here to talk for a sec about some of the designs that are going and some of the idea that's there. I'll probably do this again in just a moment. But yeah, so this is the character so far. My biggest concern is going to be how to get that mech kind of put with the character. Because I feel like the thing about Agent 76 is he doesn't rely on other people. He kind of relies on himself. So therefore, he probably wouldn't rely on a, on a mech to be his big thing. So how do we make that? How do we force that into the character? And I have an idea. Let's see where that goes.
Okay, so here we are with this dude who still does not have a name. DVA76, I'm going to call him so far. <laughs> D-Badass, is how, as I will say. He has uh, this undersuit, kind of like, uh, as you can see here, like on his chest and neck, like DVA has. But he also has this jacket covering it, very much so like uh, Agent 76 has. I gave him this mech arm, so you can see, to, to kind of give him that mechanical feel, but also kind of still fits in with the... Uh, with the um, the feel of the rest of the gang, I'm gonna give him like an emoji sticker. And maybe like a, almost like a bumper sticker type thing. I, I really like doing these bumper stickers. If you look at any of my other stuff, like my DeviantArt and things, they, they all, a lot of them have, I'm not gonna say all, but they a lot of them have like iHeart and why stickers and things like that I think it just gives it a little bit more personality a little bit more character appeal you know makes it makes it personal like there's some story behind that and I'm also gonna give him a bubble gum because he's a young guy he's a young he's a young gentleman he's a young boy just enjoying the little things in life, you know, like bubbles. But yeah, so this is not even the big part. I know you're like, oh, he doesn't even look, he looks like a boy version of DVA. What the heck? You give him a mech arm and you think that's it? No, ladies and gents. Wait, because there's a lot more. Okay? One sec. Okay, so here he is. This is the uh, Diva Agent 76 hybrid. Just going to grab my eraser from behind my microphone and camera there. Get rid of some of these lines. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with this character. I'm going to go ahead and color him, put him up on my DeviantArt. That's going to be under Mr. Greenlight, because I haven't had a chance to uh, to change the name at all. So I'm just going to leave that there. But I'll put a link down at the bottom. But this will be colored. This will be posted. Um, huge thank you to Fanfic Writer for suggesting this character and for uh, suggesting Raw as well. And again, you can see the rest of these on my DeviantArt page, which again I will put in the in the comments below. But uh, let's think of a name for this guy real quick. This is Agent Seventy Six DVA. So the big thing about DVA is she's a big mech person. She's a big video gamer. You know, Agent Seventy Six is uh, <laughs> well, the first thing that comes to mind is uh, Agent Forty Seven, but um. Oh, that would actually, no. Hmm. No, I was going to say that would actually work, but I, I don't think it actually would at all. So, uh, DVA and Agent 76. Some sort of mech base name. <sighs> Agent 420. Actually, you know what? As, a t as like a person who's like a teenager type person, I think if this were a real character, 
they would absolutely love the name <laughs> Agent 420. So this here is Agent 420. Actually, binary. I think binary sounds cool. Uh, you know, I'll think about it, but I, I, so far I like Agent 420. We'll see what we can change about it later. But thank you for watching. Thank you for checking this out. Uh, I appreciate you. You are the best. And uh, hasta la vista. Spanish for bye.